I never tried it before. I mean, I might. Oh, you are fairly young, huh? Yeah. You, I mean, I mean, your generation look as me. I'm 24. Y'all probably look at me as old now, huh? Yeah, definitely, definitely. I'm definitely. old from being 24. Yeah. That's crazy. It's only four. How old I are mean, you? not old. You ain't old. I think you old when you turn. I ain't gonna lie. I think you old when you like 27. 27 is 26, old. 26, 27. Yeah. I'm fucked in three years. Yeah. I really, think. really 25 <clears throat> and up though. But you know, shit. You give me benefit of that. So definitely. this is my last year. I gotta get it, and I can't. Yeah, fuck, yeah, I can't yeah. fuck no more younger hoes. Nothing like that after this. I that was your girl right there, bro. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> she used to it, bro. I'm he just to get the he liked oh, this, oh, bro. Oh, yeah. I'm just Young, trying to get the perspective. Younger as in what? 18? No, yeah. Oh, hell no. Nah. 25 and 18? That's crazy. Yeah, it is. Nah, crazy. Don't do nothing like that. Yeah, don't do nothing like that, kids. Because like, you will be looked at as a creep from these young niggas. That's all that Facts. matters. Yeah, nah. We looking at you wild. Don't do nothing. You're going like to be that. canceled. That was not even the I'm thing. I don't know if you'll be canceled. I don't know. Nah, I don't think so. 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 Nah, I don't Tension like when I was in high school and it was like it would be weird to date like a freshman. Like I always felt like that too. So I feel like that that thing has always been around. Yeah. But um sorry guys, we running, we good. Welcome back to the show. The one and only one and podcast on the is earth. We're here for another week, another banger. And today I'm talking to somebody somebody that I want to get to know. He he been doing he been doing, he running up running the numbers up and, and all that. But today I'm talking to John Doe. Yeah, yeah, John Doe. Yeah. John Doe. Yes, sir. What's up with you? I'm great. I'm, I'm sorry. Great. I have to announce we have a co-host Brittany here. Give her a round of applause for her too. Yes, got a co-host. Usually just be one on one, so hopefully she don't fuck the interview. Oh, yeah, okay. It's cool, it's cool. She be alright. Let's. What's up with you? How your day going? It's going cool. It's going great. Anything new? New today? Yeah. Like how was like how was your day, nigga? I'm asking. Day was cool. Going great. What is what is your what is your regular schedule like? You see, I remember you just graduated. Um. <laughs> My regular schedule? Yeah. I just be in the house, play the game. Okay. Nothing crazy. Shit. Um, what is you don't have no routine like you don't routine, go for a might, jog or nothing? Might might go to the gym, come back home, play the game again. Uh. Routine eat. Are you a diet? Do you like not eat meat, red meat, or some shit like that? Do you have a diet or something? I don't eat pork. You don't mm. eat pork. Why? Yeah. Oh, is he a religionist? No, nah, it's not. No, nah, it's just like I just look at it like mm. I, should, good, I shouldn't though. do that. Ribs, pork ribs are good. Not really a fan. Wow, I feel like you cut you cut yourself off of pork for your life. You start. No, nah, I've been. I, I'm, not, I'm not saying I never eat pork before. I'm oh, just saying okay. like I just stopped. Like I just started looking at it like. Why would I be eating that? Like, you know where it come from, right? Okay. That shit looks crazy. <laughs> what, pigs and shit? Yes. Where does everything else come from? Everything else is dirty, gang. We clean everything else off. Pigs, though? Yes, pigs. pigs. I can't get jiggy with the pigs. And what you eat pork? You defending pork head? Yes, I'm you a pork, pork defender. Too? No, I don't, oh, personally. Right, right. She about to eat some pork. You better be eating pork. I'm a pork defender. It's like, nah, I'm joking. Yeah, I'm joking. Yeah. Let's, get into the real, let's get into the real reason. People know you from your YouTube videos and, and your content. How would you describe your content? I mean, I would say funny, maybe. Funny. I don't, funny. It's fun, yeah, 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 but funny, I mean, I don't really know how other people react to it, but when I look at it, I be laughing. So It's I entertaining. Mm-hmm. You watched it? Hell yeah. Well, I probably watched. I haven't watched all your 20B ones. Yeah. Uh, probably, I've watched majority of them. Why do you how do you plan your how do you plan your um schedule schedule your, do you have like a drop in schedule or do you drop once every month or something? Nah, see, I mean it just be random. I'm I really trying to be more consistent with it though, like um like a schedule. Mm-hmm. I will I will want to drop every week. Yeah, yeah, that's That'd what I want to do. do. Yeah, That'd be hard that's what do. I want to do. How be how hard is it already now getting? Because I know it's hard to get five hoes together. Oh wow! I mean, five women together. Thank you. It's yeah. hard to get five women together. How does it to get twenty women together? I mean, it's not me doing it. It's somebody mm-hmm. else doing it. So it'd be easier for me. Oh, now. so you mm-hmm. just you more so just direct. And, uh, your nah, like I would contact somebody and they and they this is that's what they do get girls together. Oh okay. Yeah. Now, before I knew the people that do stuff like that, it was hard. Okay. Yeah. Like, how how like how like hard is it? Like, that? super hard. Like, mm-hmm. yeah, please. like, in Baltimore, you know, most of my videos are not in Baltimore. So, we're just going to say, in Baltimore, it's hard as hell to get 
people in videos. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it is. Yeah, people, people, people think they have their own celebrity in that self, so they don't facts, even try facts. to get on camera. Yeah. I don't know what it'd be like. Are you originally from Baltimore? No, I'm originally from New York. New York? What the hell are you doing over here? <laughs> uh, my grandfather had lived out here. Okay. Yeah, and then we had came out here to visit, and then we ended up staying. Mm-hmm. Go back. Yeah. Ain't nothing. How how was it? I know. How, was you were you too young to like really know the New York life? Do you remember New York? Which one? I mean, better? which I mean, I was only I was six when I moved, so I can't really like. Mm. It was like cool in New York, but like I can't really. I grew up here. You're Baltimorean. Yeah, <laughs> you're Baltimorean. Um, talk about some. How do you? How did you first come across doing your first twenty one? Talk. Walk me through that process, because I know it's just like you know uh, the first one compared to the last one. Like, how do you? How was your first twenty v one? Like, tell, tell me how one? you got into that era. I mean, like you talking about where it was actually twenty people. Yeah, yeah. No, like, no, 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 no. I want. Oh, you talking about the first one I, wanna, I published? I want to take it back to all the way when you first got the idea. Like, tell me what was going around back. The first then. idea. No, I mean, the first I, idea of doing it, like, like I how mean, what was going around it. So you saying like the first one I ever did, really? Basically, yeah. Okay, so it was with a, um, it was with the girl Bree, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It was here. I had seen somebody post her, and I was like, first, first before I started doing videos, I was just texting anybody like, "You trying to do a video? You trying to do a video?" Mm-hmm. People was just declining. I mean, people wasn't responding. She responded, and uh, it was after that. Uh, we did the video, but it never dropped, though. It was a crazy video. Never dropped, though. What, what, why did like, it drop? It was like only like eight people, only like eight guys came. It wasn't even 20. But, oh, it was 8v1? Yeah. That's why you couldn't vote? But it was hilarious. No, we recorded the video, uh-huh. and then the video came out with no sound. Mm. Oh yeah. wow! Heartbreaker. Technical difficulty. Damn. Craziest video I Boy. ever. Fun, matter of fact, not craziest. Funniest video I ever shot. Never. But ever. it was no nobody was recording sound. Nope. Fuck. Oh, that would hurt me, bro. Yeah. If I did this whole interview and it didn't have sound, I was I was swinging, yeah, bro. It was crazy. Oh. It's like, I'm joking. I'm joking. Oh okay. <laughs> that was wild. I ain't gonna lie. I'm sorry, I didn't mean like that. Heartbreaking. But the technical difficulties with the cameras and shit, that's definitely an asshole. Like yeah. that's a pro- that's a process to deal with. Do you do you um do you um direct yourself or do you usually hire a cameraman? Direct I can't I can't film and be a, be the host at the same time. So you, you just you just more so like you more so try to just stay on camera, yo. Yeah, yeah, no, it's I was, it's people doing the camera work. You don't even worry about that more so do you do you don't edit anything? No, I don't edit, no. Oh, oh, so you, I want to start editing though, cause like people be, uh, it's cool. I ain't, no, go ahead. Nah, what you're saying. nah. It's like I feel like if I edit it, my videos would be funnier. That's all I'm saying. But they still be funny. But you know, mm. some people be taking like the other funny stuff out of the video. So what would you say your role is in being a twenty v one? Of course, your on camera personality. Twenty v one. I mean, really, a twenty v one. All you do is just. Sit behind the camera, let the girls or guys do whatever. I mean, you say something here and there. Twenty v one, you don't really say that much. Okay, okay, I understand. What what is that? The is that the is that the content that you would see yourself getting into? Like, what? That, like the type of content that you do now is that how when you first started wanting to get into content creation? Is that the content that you kind of say see saw yourself getting into? When or did I you first thought about doing YouTube? Yes, yes. Oh no, I don't know. What was you doing before? No, nah, I'm saying, you saying, like, when I first thought about YouTube, that I think, oh, I'm just going to do 20v1s. Mm-hmm. Nah. Because when I first thought about doing YouTube, 20v1s wasn't out. No, it wasn't. Nah. No, I'm just, that's what I'm asking. Like, yeah. what was going on around that time of your life? Like, oh, when I first what, thought about yeah, doing that's YouTube? That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm I thinking. was 13. Yeah, that's young. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I was playing basketball. Okay. Yeah. But so I, see, got into I seen it. I mean, that's how I started. Yeah, interested in it when I started watching it at thirteen. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and f- since then, since then, so you had your channel since you were thirteen. That's that's the no, same no, no. I wanted to do YouTube since I was thirteen. Like I was interested in doing YouTube since thirteen. And then, I had my channel since April. Oh, mm-hmm. this is that's a fresh channel. Yeah. Damn, mm-hmm. I would have never known that. I've shit. How did you? How did you? How do you kind of market that with a with a brand new channel? How do you market that for an audience? I mean, I just post, post it on Instagram. That's it. Mm-hmm. And he just, I don't know. This is how I've been. Mm. 
I'm one person. I want to get into the questions. I want to get into the grill. I want to talk about the grill. <laughs> you, it's a custom grill. I want to talk about it. That's just how it go. Nigga come up here with some jewelry. I want to talk about it. Um, <laughs> how long have you had them grills? Since March. Okay. Yeah. So they fairly new. I guess yeah. Sure. How how are you? How are you like? Were you a grill person before then, or this your first time getting into? No, grill? no. I've been. I've been. Yeah. I had fronts. I mean, yeah. These basically fronts, but I had gold teeth and all that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I used to. Yeah. Before. Yeah. yeah. What was what was the price range? What was your what was the price range to get into that? Because I know you don't just go in there and just it's not because them them jewelers know I'm broke. They be looking at me. The price range. Uh, I mean, there's different price ranges everywhere you go. I mean, I don't really. Yeah, it, it kind of do be like as you go. Yeah. What type of person were you in high school before you graduated? Before I graduated. Yeah. Like you saying, like right before you saying, like all oh, the years. Yeah, like how? What type of person were you in high school? Basically? I was cool. Uh huh. I was just chilling. You was just chilling. Yeah, I wasn't no. What, what you like? Like what type of person? Were you a funny guy? Was you a funny nerd? guy? Were you mean, a nerd or something? It wasn't like, no nerd. Nah, <laughs> nerd is like that, that's that's overboard. Nah, I was just I was chilling. I mean, I was. Uh huh. Funny guy. I mean, you could say that. Class clown, like being loud in the class and all that. Mm-hmm. Nah, that's kind of overboard, but. Funny, I would say so. I mean, not, now, tr- not trying to be funny, but um, a lot of people, a lot of people would say that uh, just specifically Baltimore school systems has been failing recently. You just coming from there, how was your experience? Because um, <laughs> I remember when I was in high school, I, I was selling weed to my teacher. I ain't. Gonna I lie. mean, I think it's about dumb Britain don't. Oh my god! I think it's about what you want to do. I don't think you could just sit right there and just blame the school system. It's about what you want to do. You want to graduate? You gonna graduate? Can't blame it on the school system. Mm. Yeah. Are you religious? Nah. I don't, nah. What do you mean though? No? Like you saying, do I believe in God? Yeah. Of course. That was that's that's. Oh, right, no, I thought you were talking about like Muslims or something. Like that. No, no, religious is yeah. do, you, do you believe in a higher power? That's more. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course, of course, yeah. What is what is something for other younger content people out watching this right now? What are some of the key things that you implemented into your content to get this audience? I mean, you're saying like I got this huge audience or something like. But the audience is an audience. You get viewership I mean, way more than me. That's what I'm saying. I'm trying to learn my damn self. Market. Market. Yeah. Like yeah. like what like, like I know I know getting a, I know you don't just consist- DM I consistency know- I ain't lie you definitely consistent I think it's consistency I mean and it- I think people gotta actually want to watch stuff because I ain't gonna lie people be having like hundreds of videos and it be he be having nothing like forty subscribers I feel you hundred videos forty subscribers or two hundred subscribers mm-hmm. that's kind of wild yeah that is kind of wild I need to get on my grizzly grizzly I don't want to be one of them I had to or you get people to promote your stuff. Why don't I? No, I said, or you could get people. Oh, to I could. Yeah, stuff. I could, but like niggas yeah. be niggas be stingy with with their Instagram pages. Like, what you mean? Like oh, nigg- with niggas the collab be stingy. Posts? Not even collab posts. Like just post in general. Like every every time I I send up niggas to post and they like I drop the interview everything and they just they just they just be like they just don't do anything and they just like, at, least, at least like the picture, nigga. Damn. <laughs> I feel you. Uh, like niggas no be daddy. stingy. I really with that feel Instagram. you, no daddy. Feel and it's like, why would you be like? Why do you think niggas be so stingy with that Instagram? Why do you think some stingy niggas oh, stingy with Oh, me. me she too. know. She know. She probably be stingy with her Instagram. I'm not stingy with my Instagram. Um, There's just certain things I won't promote. <laughs> Damn, if you did a whole interview, you won't even post it. Uh, yeah, no, no, no. I'll promote him. She's not the niggas I'm talking about. This your cousin, though. Yeah, I'll promote him any day. You're talking about somebody else doing the interview with you. Look, you post it? Yeah, I am. Okay. Yeah, I am. Okay, so I mean, a lot of niggas are looking for money because they be charging um, to have that shit up on their story for like twenty four hours or on their page for a certain amount of time. So yeah, that's n- niggas just after money. That is, that is Somebody pretty. ever try to charge you? Charge me to interview them? Yeah. Yeah. OTR Chas. Okay. I was talking to him. We was we was I was texting him like almost like for like two weeks straight. We was talking to each other and it seemed like he was down. But then, like, I guess, like, he got new management or something, or, mm-hmm. and then he just texted me, just charged me one day, like, like yeah, four bands, five, five bands. Five bands? I mean, it's all about me. Like, nigga, you see my YouTube is not monetized. Where am I get this five bands from? <laughs> I just dropped the whole video talking about quitting my job. Where am I get this five <laughs> bands from, nigga? But that's neither here nor there. Yes, somebody shot me before. How do you, how do you, I know, I want to talk about your interview with Tinkerbella. How did you, how did you get into contact with her? 
With her? Mm-hmm. I mean, I contact her manager and then that was just went from there. Oh, it was that easy? Now, do you do you charge do do you um do you pay people to come on your videos? Personality? Yeah, ain't shit free. No hell yeah. <laughs> ain't shit free. Yeah. How much yeah. do you charge people? I mean, how much do, do, I do you, how much do you pay people to come on your videos? I mean, they got how much do I pay them? I don't just pay them oh flat rate. They all got different prices. Yeah, they all got different prices. Yeah. Um, talk about um. I know. I know. Just getting into um, YouTube and monetization and, and all that shit like that. How has that affected you? Getting in, like, can you reword the question? Like monetization. Like when you, when you first started your YouTube, you probably wasn't monetized. Like compared to now, you know what I mean. How has how has that do? You, what kind of what changes do you see? Changes. Like there's money the, there's being the, in the account now. Is the, is the, <laughs> but I'm talking about like walk me through that. Pro, I want to because my my YouTube isn't monetized yet, and right, I want right. to and I want to know the feeling. I want to understand the feeling of having a monetized YouTube. Oh, channel. like so like like, like when like, you first get monetized. Yeah, like, like what, your first YouTube check or like your biggest YouTube check. Like you don't have to say number specifically, but just I want to talk about that period of time in your life. Period of time in my life. I still haven't got a YouTube check. What? Yeah. What? Yeah. Oh my goodness. You know, I just I just got monetized. Just now, yeah. Like how, like how? I mean, let's. So it's you gotta. I believe you gotta have five hundred subscribers and four thousand watch hours to become a partner. Mm -hmm. To start getting paid, you gotta get a thousand subscribers. Oh. Okay. I just got a thousand subscribers like two months ago. Wow! Congratulations. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. What is what is some of the what are some of the key things that you did to to get there? Like, I mean. Drop a video. Drop videos. Drop videos. Drop good content. I feel like yeah, a lot yeah, of drop good content. A lot yeah. of the time, a lot of the people that I talk to as content creators, um, uh, the same, the, the the kind of it's not the it's never the same answer, but it's kind of like the the kind of the gist that they saying is just just genuinely creating good content for people mm -hmm. to watch. Yeah. And and I feel like that's important. And and I and I mean a lot of people they just they just out output a lot. They don't even think about like sit back and watch your own video. Yeah. Are you entertained? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You can't just be putting out a hundred videos and. None of them entertaining. What, 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 nobody's what watching doing? that. Oh shit! I'm talking to Dwight. Um, yeah, nobody not watching that shit. What do you feel like? What do you feel like for somebody that is capturing viewership? Um, you can you can have you have analytics to see what people like, what people don't like. Where do you think that the the market is going? Like, where do you think people? Because of course, twenty. I mean, you know I mean, what what do you think the market is headed? Like, where do you think this market will go years from now? What twenty v ones? You think it'll die down or something? No, I'm not thinking. I'm not saying it's. I'm not saying specifically twenty v ones. I'm saying like, I'm saying where do you just right now in this moment that we are as 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 content creators, where do you think this is headed? Like, do you think it's going to be more going let lean more into live streaming or like you know what I mean? Like, because I, I me personally, I think it's going into more of like a YouTube is going to be a competitor to Netflix. I think we are going to be. Like having our own Squid Game series on there. That's what a kind of. I mean, look at music. look at Mr. Beast. Exactly. Yeah, that's what it's looking like right now. I'm talking about for us, nigga. We not Mr. Beast. <laughs> for us, I don't know. I can't. I can't tell the future, bro. What do you like? What do you like most about content creating? What do I like most? I mean, during the videos, the videos be fun. Mm. Be fun doing it. And what would you say is the most stressful times, the worst times of content creating? Um, I know for sure when the audio don't work, so that's one. For sure. Technical difficulties. That's the technical part. difficulties is the worst part. That's the worst part for sure. What was it? What would you say your best experience? My best experience? Yes, from from this whole experience of content creating, of having a YouTube channel and putting out people for shit to watch. What is your best? What is your? What has been your best experience? Is it the viewership? Is it the like you said the live moments when you're in there? In the, it was it was the live moments for sure, live moments for sure. It was one video. It was one video. I know. I know. First time. I know you don't. When you pick a when you pick, oh you said you don't even pick the women. Who picks the women? It's like I mean I mean so. It was I mean it was one time I had to pick the women. How many women was? It, it was like the first video. With Vontae. Mm -hmm. So we walk in, we walk in there, it's just like, it's like 30, it's no, it's like, yeah, it was like 30 something women. What? Yeah. That was a shady room, huh? But look, <laughs> it's 30 something women, but you gotta pick 20 in front of all of them. So oh, it's like, you eliminate some, of them, some of them not gonna be in it. Like, you gotta, 
Hey, you you gonna be in the video? Go over here. How do you decipher that? that? Look the looks. The looks. Damn. Yeah. Damn. And whoever got a wild personality, you can't just have looks and some of them boring. Mm. Yeah. Damn. You got a question to ask about that? That was crazy. That was that, that was, was a damn. damn. That was a wild. <laughs> I mean, but it's the truth though, nigga. That was wild <laughs> for my real. First twenty v one, I was crazy. I that's life, lie. though. That's, yeah. that's life. Yeah, like, yeah. Sure. But most of them ended up being in the video anyway. Though. That's good. Yeah, that's good. Do you do you keep in contact with the women? Do you recycle them? The keep recycle in... is crazy to say. I'm <laughs> so sorry. Recycle? Was that a bad word? Yes. Reuse them. Do you reuse them? And fix that's them? not a bad. <laughs> that's I mean, he know what the fuck I'm talking about. Yeah. Mm. If they want to be in the video, yeah. I don't text them. Again. Mm. If they want to be in another video, I will do that. Mm. Mm. So where do you see where do you see the future of your YouTube channel? Do you My see, YouTube channel? Yeah, the future of it. What, you, what content do you see? Crazy. What content? You said what kind of? Not content not even because I know you don't. You're not just gonna do twenty one forever. Yeah, no, I don't know. That's what I'm saying. Like, where do you? Where do you I'm not even thinking like that right now. I'm just. That's what I'm saying. Like, yeah. what type of? Where, where's your mindset? I'm trying to get away. My mindset, mindset. All types of things. Vlogs. You know. Challenges. Everything. Like I, expanding everything. Not just twenty v ones. That's crazy. Like. So more content where people could like know my like personality. Can't really show too much in the twenty v one. Yeah. Okay. Um, this is kind of I ask this question to everybody that come that comes here. Um, when you when so this is this is a question I ask everybody when they come here. When so say if it's Friday night, you just got paid. What's the move? What you gonna do? I'm gonna ask you that, and I'm gonna ask Britt. Britt. I mean. You said I was broke before the pay the, the the check. That's what you said. No, no, I'm saying like when you when you when, when it's Friday night and and it's time to go out. What's what you what's the move? Like I'm trying to see where you hit at. That's pretty much it. Like it's time to go out, or it's like, like yeah, I might be in the house. So you Damn, saying, you going no, clubbing like, or something? Like uh, you going clubbing or you going out with your that's people? What I'm you going to the like club, what you doing? Like, it's time to go out. Like, yeah, it's really, time to go out. Like, out. Like, guys, you, you not inside. You with the guys. Out yeah. And, how, saying, and, and a backhand question: How much do you end up spending? Like, where we go, hold on? Where we like? What I, city? Give him a scenario. What's, yeah. what's, 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 your city city? what's your best city? Like, what's your, what, what city do you like going to? I'm the saying. Most? We, I'm saying. Let's just talk about. Say we in Baltimore. All right, we in Baltimore. We going to the strip club. What the strip club? What strip yeah. club you recommend? Ah, he about it. He about it. Yeah, come on. What no, strip I club? Been, don't say no I haven't names. been to that many strip clubs in Baltimore, so I can't really say. But so where you been? I at? definitely like Lust though. Lust. Okay, people mm-hmm. always love Lust. I ain't people even gonna lie. Yeah, I fuck with Lust. It is nice. I I fuck with Lust. <laughs> 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 I ain't never been. We ain't never been. We going. You never been to Lust. Never been to Lust. Hey. I only been in one strip club in Baltimore. You not you what strip club that was? Damn, I don't know. It's on like Baltimore Street or something, like on a corner. I don't remember. Oh, what it's no. Normas. No. Mm. No, I don't know. You must be talking about one of them, the, them white ass titty boys. No, yeah. it's not. They was all <laughs> black females. They looked good. Tight shit, tight shit. What do you? What do you? Um, what do? I know you can't. Like you said, you have to pick women, and it's about looks. What 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 what, um, what what kind of how do you decipher that? Cause like it's twenty like a hundred women like it's of course like you might you might come across a baddie with no personality. No nah, no nah, that was only one time though. I didn't mean mm-hmm. to cut you up. That was only one time though. Oh so but yeah, now you usually, don't have to worry about that, huh? Okay so look it's it's casting agents. That's what they do. So you, oh, you know, okay. contact them. Say you need this this this. They send you who gonna be in the video. You pick. Mm-hmm. Won't be in the video. You'd be like, oh, I don't want her. Are these people usually like people that are known in the city or like? What you mean? This is I'm talking about. I'm talking about casting in Atlanta. Oh, casting oh okay. In, casting in Baltimore. I didn't. They don't, they don't ask me who want to be in it. They oh, just okay. come with the people. Damn. So you, I know. I know specifically. It's, they be taxing just to rent out the the type of size of studio you would need. For sure. For that. So. So where is the best? You said Atlanta is the best place to film. Like, where where is your favorite place to film at? Um, I only film outside of Atlanta and Baltimore one time, so I can't really say. I like Atlanta better though, for sure. Mm-hmm. It's, mm, why? It's easier. Oh, it's easy. Why, I just you, know. why are you making it's that no, look though? Atlanta like Atlanta is the host. I know. I heard they bad in Atlanta. Was I heard right. they bad in Atlanta. Bad. Atlanta. Bad. 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 It's just you feel what I'm saying it's an easier process. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Cause in Baltimore, like he said, he had to find the the, the women themselves, yeah. and rather than in Atlanta, he can have a casting agency. No, no, I got a casting here now. I just found a casting recently here, recently mm-hmm. here. 
But before that, yeah, hard as hell. Now tell me about. I know it's a, it's a, I, I, I know it's a different threshold from when that process of when you're not monetized is when you are. Yeah. Talk to me about that. I mean, I mean, I mean, I'm not talking about like how much you made exactly, but like it's it's a it's a it's like a uh, like a weight off your shoulders. Like this, is what you've been working for. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, like how has yeah. that how has that been for you? I mean, you said it just happened, so I feel like it's yeah, kind of now it's like you know what I'm saying showing you you getting a few dollars now. When before it was just like. Doing this shit, shit just looking like nothing really like what am I, I doing this for i kind of this might not be this might be a too personal question but i am curious well how, how would you say your support system because like now you have from from not being monetized to being monetized you can go to this person be like hey look look now look look what i'm look at this now you know what i'm saying <laughs> how has that been for you i mean i ain't really say i don't really be like that what you just said but i mean like people the people that do support me actually support me truly support me already believe in me so they already know where it's going mm. they, they already, like they're not surprised they already see it. yeah no nah, they already see it the people that actually that's great truly support me that's great i think you are really i think you're really for one you're 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 you uh, uh, black creators we need more of those period facts because Mr. Beast, I don't want my kids watching Mr. Beast. I want, I'd rather have my kids watch a, 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 a John Doe video than John, Mr. Beast, personally. Cause I'm just, okay. I just such a, I'm just such black a- Black support, Phil. Yeah, advocate yeah. for that shit. Why, 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 do you, why do you think it's not more black creatives as that? You think niggas is just in that shell too much and think they too good to make a YouTube channel? I mean, I feel like a lot of people, um, a lot of more people wanting to do content now. Mm-hmm. But I mean, some people do be in their show though. I personally be in my show. I had a nigga come on. I asked a nigga for an interview. He came on here. I was like, "Yeah, what you think about my podcast? Was it cool?" He was like, "Yeah, I just feel like you don't give a fuck." Mm-hmm. You feel like you don't? He said he feel like you don't give a fuck. Yeah. And I was like, "Yo, why but, you feel like that?" It was like, "Yo, cause you you wear a dingy ass white tee all the time." Damn. <laughs> I didn't even know I wore a white tee all the time until he that second he said that shit to me. You ain't changed it either. Why you ain't changing? Why? Ain't, why are you? I'm busy here? today. I don't, I don't got. I need. I need to pack you don't white tees. So what you so, what you supposed to be dressed in? I'm like, what should I be dressed in? I mean, dressing what you prefer. That's what you've been. That's how you rock all your life. This is literally how he rocks all I his life. Okay, don't don't you know I mean? don't. I keep it simple. Don't don't change then. That's how you rock all your life. Do your thing. That's what I'm saying. I thought it was. They need to make sure it's a problem because I don't got on the goddamn. Like, I mean, I ain't gonna lie though. Just rocking a white tee is kind of crazy. Though. It's like, crazy. Yeah, like just. I can't even. I'm trying to think of somebody in my head that just white tee. I'm a nigga. It's not even just. I no, no, white tee is cool. I'm just saying that. Just a casual, just you just like you about to go take out some trash. You got to take out, <laughs> you got to take out trash, man. Like, Damn. That's, <laughs> like that's crazy. I ain't gonna lie. Like I can't really think of nobody. Like I feel like people would be like trying to. So they, you feel me? So basically, as you, I would, I would say you yourself would call yourself as as one of the young niggas and as in that generation. And I would say that, I, and I'm and I'm and I'm and you, and you as a young nigga saying that I don't have no drip. Not right now. No, I, I, I don't know what you wear, other, but no, you got no drip. Right now. <laughs> this, is how drip. He, this is how he dress every day. Like, it's no, I'm not... saying, you ask me, do you not have drip? Is you saying that's drip? No, it ain't. It ain't drip. I, it's not the best I could put on. Oh, okay, okay. But it's it's what I feel comfortable in. Not if anybody say that's drip, that's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> anybody say that drip, cut them off. They look in your face and lying. But so Antoine, we not fucking. <laughs> You said I was cool doing that shit. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm not cool. Out. I'm calling niggas out. Damn. No niggas off the tip of my tongue talking about my damn white tee. I like wearing white tees, nigga. I like wearing white tees. I ain't gonna lie, your white tee not really clean, though. <laughs> Real shit. Like, yeah, yeah, you know, I said your shit was fresh. Like, Yo, you had yeah, fresh yeah. out the pad. Oh, for real. Your shit tight, like. Your shit the, not crispy. At this, all. The, this, 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 like, at this, like. Your shit hella loose. <laughs> oh, daddy. <laughs> Shorty, order some white tees right now on the website. <laughs> go on the go on the computer. Yeah, order yeah. some white tees. Hanes, Hanes only. <laughs> not Gilbert, not Gildan. Do you even have a tank top on? No, no. bro. You like, <laughs> 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 hey, wait, where you from, bro? I'm in the trench, nigga. Bottom. I don't know what part of the trenches you from. The village. 
Oh, like, damn. Everybody I know grew up like this. I don't even like everybody I grew up with. Was you don't like, even throw the tank top on them? No tank. Why the tank top? What's the tank top for? That's, that's hot. Hot. Come you on. got on the tank top right now? Yes. I've been wearing tank tops all my life. Bro. I gotta wear a tank top. As the as the women as the women voice, it like it like make your shirt like fit better. Yeah, like, just like maybe a that's black why your shirt. shit all time. loose and shit. Like, it is. It's not. A, it's a little no wrinkle. Mm. Damn. Did you order the t shirts yet? <laughs> Got them. Put them. Go on Amazon. I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it at HR department and I'm gonna, I'm gonna work <laughs> on it. Yeah, hit get management some, get some fresher, up, man. Get some get some fresher white. I can teams. be in management. I got I got you. I, I I do this shit. This is this is all in house. I do this shit. I hit niggas up. I'm like, yo, come sit down. You got a good story. I want to get it on camera. That's 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 how this shit started from. Okay, what you think he could improve on? What you mean, like content wise? Like, yeah. Or what are you talking about? Co- Damn. Content wise. I'm I, asking. Make sure I cut that out the video. He <laughs> no content wise. I mean, I don't know. I watch you. Seem shit seem cool. Like you're real consistent. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Um. Get some bottles of water for niggas. Like, you feel me? Shit. Damn. Damn. I need some bottles of water. Okay, here. write that down, Kayla. Yeah, for, I need some. I need no, some just because when I see water. other interviews, they be having water for niggas and shit. Yeah. You feel I, be, I used to have water, but I ran out. You know oh, you got he, the juice for me. Yeah, he got the juice. Got the juice, got the liquor. I usually had a whole bit bot for you, but I ain't, I need to re up. I can't even lie. This one, I need to re up. I can't even lie to you. That's okay. We're going to do the glass cups. Anything other than that, though, I really want to know, though. This thing. Like, okay, what about the fit now? All right, we're uh, gonna I ain't going to keep going, going into you. <laughs> I ain't going to keep going into your fit, bro. You can talk. I'm not, I'm not a, I got thick skin. You're not going to hurt me. I'm okay. Yeah. I I only see the really shirt. I don't really. They shorts? Yeah, I got on the regular Hoopman shorts, Nike. No, I'm drip. Crocs. Crocs. Fur and fur on inside. Oh drip. my gosh. Nah, okay, you can see nah, he the flash guitar. Uh-uh. You the more. How flash flash I want flash? I got on the regular Nigga, smile. Black. Smile for the no, camera. That's like, a smile. What? I got a regular black sweatsuit on. How that's flashy? Regular nah, it's, it's your mouth, bro. I came here with Balenci's on. It's and your mouth, bro. I don't understand what you're saying. The Balenci's. I can crazy. see. I can see right? your mouth from like so far Niggas away. Came that shit shot. I, I mean, ain't nothing wrong with that, not, but I'm just saying. She called me flashy. I'm, I'm, I'm Plus, like, it's nothing wrong with him being. He should be flashy. This on, is his enemy. I got on Jordans. Like, That's what I'm saying. Man, he should come in a black sweatshirt. I didn't even look you up and down, so sorry. I'm just sorry. saying. You got the drip on, though. I, I got the drip you, on. I'll tell you. It's casual it. wear. It's casual? This really what you should have on for in your interview. Some casual yeah. wear. Yo, this take a picture. Take a picture here to tell him. This casual wear? This is his casual wear. Bro, I'm a comfortable nigga, man. I feel you. I, I I I do my work, I get my good content, and I don't think about the outfit no. I'm gonna wear. That's the type of shit you wear to bed. Not gonna lie. I I sleep. That's why I sleep that's in my the trash taking outfit. Yeah, I'm yeah. Trying. you got that. That was that was what, a good one. That was a good analogy. That was no for real. real trash. <laughs> this is now to get the trash taken out podcast. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? What you what do you think young creators need in that? What do you think the the viable thing young creators need in that content? To get it to that next level. Yeah, I don't know. You gotta be funny, be entertaining. Be be funny. Yeah, be entertaining. Is there anything that is make, it make people want to like keep watching you? I guess. Yeah. But what do you think is important? What do you think is important about con- constructing a good content video? Is it the is it the the intro? Is it the thumbnail? Is it the title? Like well, oh, how, yeah, how yeah. much? How does that? How much of that goes in? Like I mean. Thumbnail, thumbnail too. Thumbnail, like you can see a thumbnail, be like, oh, what's this? You ever did that before? Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, clickbait. Like, I'm just saying, yeah, that. Be- I'm not clickbait. Yes. <laughs> all right, all right, yeah, yeah. I mean, also people be like falsifying titles, like they say, oh, this happened in the video, and it's not happening in the video. Mm-hmm. That had to catch somebody. I'm not doing that, but that had to catch somebody. Feel me? Shit. Oh, okay. Okay. I see what you said. Mm-hmm. Where where what what are your hobbies? What do you like to do? You like you like to play the game? What are you playing two K? Do you need a big man? I got a big man. <laughs> yeah, I like playing two K. Uh, I like playing basketball. I don't really play basketball that much, but I like playing basketball. Hobbies. <laughs> yeah. No hobbies. You just. 
Can so what do you what do you, what is your day you, you said you I already just told play the you, game. Bro, I already told you, bro. You said that, but like, play the you game. Can't, you, you have you, you like, go to the gym, come home, your, play the game again. Watching your content, like you're, I feel like you're a person with more substance. Like, <laughs> like what, like what, like that's like that's every, yeah. I do that shit, nigga. You say you want to vlog. What you gonna be vlogging? What you gonna be vlogging? Vlogging. If I'm vlogging, it's gonna be me doing something exciting. Mm. Like. I'm outside doing something. You travel, you go on trips, you do all that. How much do you For travel? Sure. Mm-hmm. Um, I was traveling a lot this year, let me be honest. Where you what been? was your favorite place to, yeah, what she said. I mean, let me not say, tra- I mean, traveling, like, get on a plane, but, like, actually going places and, like, on vacation? No, I haven't been really been on vacation. I've really been, like, going places to do videos to do mm. videos yeah okay. work okay and yeah. atlanta and atlanta i know you did i know you i remember i was watching some of your content you did public content you used to uh ask people questions in public yeah that was oh that was miami yeah yeah that shit was fun yeah that shit was fun yeah walk sure. me through that process so like how you have to go there like that's like a that's like a perfect time you have to go there right? yeah that was spring break that was spring break oh yeah yeah oh you missing out bro but i mean chill my girl that's what my you gotta girl, do bro. i know i know you gotta miss Oof. out bro yeah I'm gonna get married, man. I'm not. I'm not on that shit. No, I just say you was like, like, like missing out on like fun. Not saying nothing about girls. What do you see? Yeah, what do you now? Aside from the YouTube, aside from the content and all that, what do you see for yourself in the future? You just getting out of high school, like you have a far future ahead of you. Like your future is bright as a motherfucker. I'm sure. Uh, damn. A lot. Like I can't even really like say everything. You feel me? Like I want to do a lot. To be honest with you. Mm-hmm. What do you think? What do you think some people should take from this interview? What did I really say? <laughs> I ain't really say nothing. Be real. <laughs> don't wear those type t- t-shirts. Yo, with no tank top. This is supposed to be for them, not me. Don't point at me. No, I'm giving them advice. Don't don't wear do it. that. <laughs> that do not do that. Oh shit! I mean, I can understand that. I'm sorry. Maybe I'm too. I'm too in too deep into. The content I put out, and I need to think about what the fuck I got on. Mm. That's that. You know what I'm saying? I mean, like, who really cares when your girl is right there, bro? Why would you really care? Okay. Like, I mean, who are you a, really like? You feel what I'm saying? But but also, you should really. You feel what I'm saying? Look you, a little presentable. Yeah, yeah. Because it's a perception. That's kind of wild. You gotta wild. market your brand a little bit better. That's okay. All right, don't touch the back. The little flag. Maybe you should get some. Maybe you should get some shirts, which are like um, your um. YouTube name on it or something like that. Where you shirt every episode mm-hmm. or something oh, like that. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Good idea. Yeah. 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 Then start wearing your little fanny. With a tank top though. With a tank top. <laughs> what, I, what I took from this interview, I'm gonna start wearing tank tops. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna start wearing tank tops. <laughs> well, I'm happy. I'm happy for for. I'm happy for you. I'm happy for everything that you have going on. I I can't wait to see where it comes to. Hopefully, you can come back and you can and you can flex on yeah. some more. I'm not how I'm flexing. I'm chilling. no, no, no. I'm not. I hate the. I hate the. Bro, I don't, said flexing. That's flex, crazy. Let, me, let me let me explain it. I hate flexing. It's like I hate flexing. Like that's kind of like a bad. It, I hate how they kind of yeah, flexing. Do be sounding it's, bad. It's not. It's, but I'm not saying a bad word. Like you. you yeah, no. You're not. I feel like I personally feel like you're putting out good content, and I feel like you're as a black creator, you're 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 starting to prosper for it. And I think this is a monumental. Part of your life, especially as young for as sure, you are. For sure, for sure, for sure. You know what I mean? Sure. That's that's you don't have to worry about getting monetized no more. You know what I mean? That's a whole future that I'm still on, nigga. And I'm and after this year, I'm old, as the young niggas say. Damn, but be 25. I'm 24 right 24. now. Yeah, yeah. Damn. So what should yeah, I start bro. doing after I'm 24? After like, what should what should type of activity should I, should I join a country club and like start <laughs> wearing like sandals and shit? No, nah, no, nah, you got like the 40 and up basketball league. <laughs> Can you say 37 you? Nah, 40 and up. 40 and up? That's what I should be into? <laughs> yeah, otherwise, yeah. Say, nah, 25 not that old, bro. You cool, bro. 20, I'm good. 25 cool, yeah, you good, bro. Yeah, I'm good. Like, good. when you hit, like, 27. Dick, that's only two years apart. When you hit, like, 20, I ain't gonna lie, 26 tight old, too, though. Like, Damn. Yeah. What, what happened to 10-year increments? Like, 10 years was a long Oh, time. hell no. What the nah, fuck? No, no. 26 ain't no way, nah. 26. Mm-mm. So, yeah, Brett, we got to get our shit together because we about to get <laughs> She yeah. the same age as me. I am. She a girl, though, bro. Damn. So, oh. what's the difference? What's the difference? <laughs> she can be 24 and I can't. She can be 25. Nah, 20, like 25 is like you saying, um, I mean, I don't really have a problem with it. You're female, so you're cool. But what's the difference between a, a, nigga, a nigga can't be doing like she? You can't be at, I mean... 
Yeah, no, you should be with the 24 and up club too. <laughs> I am with the 24 and up yeah, club. I'm not sure. trying to fuck with nobody that's so younger you than me. So you wouldn't go to no college party? Um, no, honestly, it's not my preference. You definitely shouldn't be at no college parties. Damn, but what? Why, he look, he gonna look like a predator or some shit? No, yeah. I'm saying like I'm saying because you about to be 25. That's kind of crazy. So what you know? Like, I, like I can't go to no homecomings. I like partying. I like you a can dance. You go to parties for sure, not college parties. Uh, Damn, I'm like, in college at, what other at parties the moment. Is there that I can't be at. What parties can I be at? That that group that age group in right there college that ain't your age group no Damn. more bro you twenty four is it okay how is it okay because I'm a female I mean twenty year olds do be coming up to me and be like hey and I'm like no that's but that's, that's that's what they should be doing though no. but maybe twenty four I don't know you shouldn't be at no college party <laughs> I am at, I'm in college <laughs> like I don't go you to go like to Morgan State. You I go do to Morgan? I do you twenty four yeah. I do. I'm trying to do the math on this. So it's never too late to go back. Of course it's not. Oh, are you started late? No, I took a, I took like two years off to be like to do financial aid stuff. Should, but. Should, yeah, you go tomorrow to be at the college parties for sure. For sure. Look, I'm one thing I will tell you though, Brittany, them, 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 them hoes, them hoes at Milford. I met I met some of the group, the, the the bottom of the barrel hoes. I, I hoes knees scabbed up from being on their oh, knees. Oh, my so knees is oh. Your knees. Okay, old. no. After what he said. No, no. I'm saying you know you know what type of girl what? I'm talking about, nigga. You know no. what I'm talking about. You know no. what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. No. Mm-mm. Yeah, no. Mm-mm. I mean, no, wait, wait, wait. Oh no, you said they knees was. No, you, you can, can just me tell. You can hit a bitch what it is. Like, mm, you want it now? Hey, yo. Yeah, but you said knees. <clears throat> the knees be looking like they fell on that, like they fell down a block on that knees. Like, oh, you said those type up. knees. Oh, why? Right. Knees scraped up, black and shit. Oh, why? Right, why? Right. Anyways, you was relating to that. Yeah. Oh, I but you really should have asked him. You should ask him some deep, like some deep, deep questions You're for his host. audience. To, look, he, you know, he's host. not used to having a host, so he just be rambling. I just be letting him go I because be I hate cutting people off. No, you be rambling, my nigga. But um, yeah. What's the question? Ask the question is. You um, asked. what are you, what are you doing like outside of your videos besides like going to the gym and stuff? What do you see like career wise besides? Career. Yeah, not besides, a job interview. The career, no, I for see real. YouTube is a career. What okay, you so career you gonna be doing that for the rest of your life? Do you plan nah. on doing it for the rest of your life? Nah, that's kind of like. Do you want to start YouTube a business? Do you want to like have something something for yourself? Like, what do you plan on doing? <laughs> or is that in the works and you can't speak about it? He don't want to tell why wouldn't I? Why wouldn't I be able to speak about it if I had a business? I would have said mm-hmm. I had a business. You said, "What do I do outside of YouTube?" I told y'all. I'll play yeah, the game. yeah, yeah. But I'll I'm talking about career. I'm not worried about you every day. I'm oh, talking about like what you want to do bigger than YouTube. You know, bigger than YouTube. Yes. Shit, I ain't even think about that. I, I, mean, I can't really think of bigger than YouTube right now because mm-hmm. I can think of me being big on YouTube, but like. Something bigger than that. I do you want to build a brand? I mean, like, I would like, say, like, one day I want to be an actor. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's bigger than YouTube. I can see yeah. you on Power, yeah. on Ghost type shit. <laughs> like, where my money at? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. That, should really end, that should really end, though. But I I, I can see me Damn. see me acting, for sure. I need to come to your house so I can watch the rest of Power, bro. I heard that shit was real good. Maybe I should just spoil it, right? No, please, please. No, no, no. Chill, chill. Mm-mm. No, I, think, I, don't, I don't do that. Don't, do that. No, listen, I think you're on the perfect track. YouTube is a career. And yeah, it's, for sure. It's you know going, what? It's going to get you farther than I have gotten. With this, are you in a relationship? Pardon? Okay. Are you in a relationship? Do you have a girlfriend? <laughs> That's what no, I don't have a girlfriend. Like, I just want to know, with this YouTube stuff, since you have to be around a hell of females, is it, like, hard in a dating world? To, yeah, it's like, a conflict of interest. Like, you, yeah. I mean, I feel like somebody should understand what's going on. Mm. Are you mature enough to be in a relationship? He is a grown ass man. That's why I know. When I was twenty, he is a grown ass man. You young as you're young as fuck. Like there's no reason to be. There's no reason to be tied down at uh, twenty apparently. So I just wanted to know, like, are you mentally ready for like a relationship? Is that something that you want or looking in your near future? In the near future. Mm Mhm. Do you want a wife? I mean, whatever wife. Wife put a ring on. Eventually. (laughs) Wife. Keep your youth. Got a lot of I got a lot of thinking to do about a wife. That's a lot. That's but, uh, he's twenty. Like, yeah, yeah, that's yeah, good yeah. But um, relationship. If that happened, that happened. Mm-hmm. I feel like mm-hmm. I, me personally, just to put my input on it. I feel like you're too young 
to even like you I feel like yo your mindset is in the right thing business and God mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. that should be where your two things will lie business and God mm-hmm. and hopefully by then um, Mariah Carey DM you back to that you. don't mean that's how it go Biz- business. that's how I met Shorty what business what no not in me oh, do business right. oh yeah I met yeah. I met her I, hit, I slid in her DM she was in, she was in Miami on a trip <clears throat> and I hit her up like damn you looking good out there in Miami <laughs> And like, she was like, when I get back to Boston, you want it? Yeah. <laughs> but that's how we met. So how long y'all been together, though? A presidential term, four years. Damn. That means you was 20. Yeah. Like me. Yeah. Is it been that long? I mean, no, it's been about three years, some change. I was going to say that. But yeah, I mean, I, mean, I don't know. That's a long ass time. Can, can like, you give some advice on how, how long, how, like, you can keep a relationship going for that long because I've never been like part of nothing that long I've never been in a year relationship damn I mean I would just say I would just say that honestly that shit is like relationships getting new relationships that shit is literally like a fucking baby you mm. know what I mean like I treat you like you you are young yourself yeah imagine if you get a relationship that would be young itself you know what I'm saying because you're growing yourself and you need to grow a relationship too type shit yeah. so it's kind of like that it's kind of like having a baby mm. And the baby is your connection with this lady. Okay. And it's hard sometimes. I'm, I would say I would consider myself young too. So it's like yeah. it's like two. You raising you two are young. Twenty four. Yeah. You raising two different kids, but yeah, you be alright, nigga. Don't worry about that. Yet. You. I ain't got nothing to say. I was just call old, and I can't go to college parties. I'm kind of old. College right parties at twenty four kind of wild though. I'm gonna go to a college party now on purposely just because you said that. So niggas can't see me at homecoming is what they saying. You you are in college, so you can do what you want. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Apparently, I don't look my age. You look about. I could have went for twenty one. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, I got nineteen recently. Nigga said I could go 19. for nineteen too. That's, That's hard, outrageous. bro. You need to take that and run with it. You can find yourself in Washington. Washington. Yeah. Damn. I'm 24, bro. Is that like... Are you not appreciating that you look 21? No, I mean, that's, I, that's I'm, I'm good. good. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm going to look good for a while. My mom look good. Take shit, take shit, take shit. I can confirm. <laughs> <laughs> what? Right. But that's, that's, maybe that's a little bit too... But this is not the Brittany and Chris interview. This is the this is John Doe. I thought she was a co-host. She is a co. She is a co-host, nigga. But this is your interview. It's not. Tell shit. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I thought she had some more st- question to ask because she said you your questions wasn't really. I was rambling. It's, it wasn't getting. I was deep. rambling. I'm sorry. I'm not trying to get what you be on. No, you you good. Keep rambling. Do your thing. What, I don't know why that's, she. What's your question? So say so. Since they Look, so I'm new to this. This is my first day. <laughs> For Ask me this question. Um. She about to ask you your type of women. You know what? Maybe they want to know that. What's your type? Told you, told you. Didn't I, I wasn't gonna ask that, but yeah, what's your type? Type of preference. What's your preference? Have you ever dated outside your race? No. Would you? I never tried it to. I mean, I. I never tried it to know. So. Mm-hmm. Don't fuck no white girl. See, so dick gonna get contaminated. Oh my gosh! What's I your preference, please? Um. I don't have a type. Hmm. Why, why would you say that, bro? Well, why would I say what? Why, why would you say he going to Oh, yeah. Would you mess with a Caucasian female before? No. No? No, I haven't. I know some people that have, and you know what I mean? Those know, like, don't don't ask nobody for no advice from, like, somebody that you don't <laughs> see, the nothing that you got going on. It's kind of like that situation. Like, you fucking that white girl, I see this type of situation. I don't want to be in that. Mm-hmm. When you first started your videos and you weren't getting, like, the views you expected, how did you keep pushing, like... Cause it, when you when you see and you only getting like ten c- couple views, it's just like how do you keep pushing after that? Yeah, I, I'm not gonna lie, that wasn't really my situation. Oh, yeah. Okay, I know that's right. <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying like, that's that's, my situation. that's what it was. It? Yeah, the first video they're like 10k four days. Oh damn! What yeah. your first video that you yeah. dropped on the one that you didn't drop that channel that you made in April? Yeah. Damn, son. I need to ask you some more questions. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You just got to be involved into what people are really watching these days. I mm-hmm. feel like that's really... My mom be sitting downstairs watching them um, watching them videos, the balloon popping videos, every faithfully, <laughs> yo, faithfully. <laughs> it's crazy. So you just got to be um, in today's media. Just involved with today's media. Shit. 
Mm-hmm. You said you want to do a real um what housewives or some some shit real baddies of Baltimore or some shit. Oh, <laughs> I want to do that too. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm yeah. actually am gonna do that. Girl, you, girl, you, like, girl, no, I'm too old. Apparently, no, I don't fight. No, I don't fight. Don't put me on that shit. Up. I, them, them young girls, they be crashing out. No, you I don't even I'm fight. It's not worth it. So that's no, not my, not my up. preference. I know. I can fight. I don't know. I don't know if you know. Them young Chris. girls, they they be looking like. I know I was born and Floyd raised in the county, but um, Chris. What you think? You think she's surviving that water dump? You think she's gonna sink it soon? Um, you don't know too much about me, so I don't, that's not even I, a question. I, for I ain't him. gonna go off of looks, bro. I ain't gonna go off of looks. You might as well. But I mean, the way you talking, should I just agree with him? Oh, okay. No, the way I'm said, talking, should, I said should I? Oh, should you? I could go on your side and be like, oh, this no. is um, to seek you. I'm right not. Here. I'm not about to vouch for. No, you just need a witness. What but I'm, I'm not gonna. Witness? But you're not gonna put me in a situation. So see you in action. No, y'all not ready to see me in action. I got a, I got an image to uphold, and anyone that's gonna associate themselves with the business world, I'm not gonna conduct myself like that. So no, I would never. But be if a bitch like that. try you, if if a what? try me, law enforcement is gonna get involved because she's gonna call the police. Yes, I am. I want to be big in this world. I don't want to be little myself. No, nobody ready to catch me on no video fighting nobody, child. Come Whoa, on now. I, 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 I'm sorry. Gonna, don't get me somebody started. trying to fight you. You want to call the police? Yes, you're getting a <laughs> charge. You're getting a, and you're getting jail time. So if I try, if I, no, I can't try to fight you. I'm a man. No, because I'm gonna just call your father. All right, don't talk <clears> about my don't talk about my father. Who's this not? Don't talk about <laughs> my father. Oh, okay, then don't talk about fighting me. What's up? We can she fight like siblings. Basically, you gonna drown in that water. Tell her. I ain't drowning in no water. I mean, nah, I have I an, an image you say to you uphold. Call the police. Sure am. I mean, a lot of people with images to uphold fight. I'm not doing that personally. I understand. Classy, real classy. What do you think people should take from this interview? Oh, you already answered that. Love. You already answered that. Be yourself. Be yourself. Yeah. And and make good content for niggas to watch. Yeah, yeah, for sure that. For sure. For sure. That, for sure that. No, oh. don't, 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 don't be. Just posting anything, thinking we supposed to watch it, cause you posted it. Don't do that. She's whack. Facts. She's whack. Post, oh, I just posted a vlog of me brushing my teeth. No, <laughs> you're not watching it. Fuck. Um, well, thank you for coming on the show. This is this. I feel like we gotta we gotta cross we gotta cross some good points here. I think we gotta cross. Yeah, I feel points. like you had enough questions, man. You don't feel like honest, I had enough man. questions? Yeah. yeah. That's how you feel. You know what I think you should do? I think you should have questions for people already in your notes, bro. I did have questions already. Oh, for real? Yeah. No, I'm saying like, like, oh, right, so you already got So you want me to have a printed piece of paper to have? No, no, like in your phone notes? You know no, saying? I tried to refrain from that. I tried to remember it. Okay, okay. I understand that. That's yeah. Cool. That's cool. But... But what do you feel like I missed out? I don't feel like I, I, I don't. I don't feel like I mean I can't really think of nothing. But I mean definitely give constructive um, criticism so people can see you get your views up. Trust me, I'm uh, what you want me to bring up. You want me to bring the baddies? I bring some baddies. Bring some baddies up in here. You know what? <laughs> Did you ever interview a girl? Yeah, I mean you plenty of women. Probably to specifically to put a number on it. Probably about five or six. That's not a lot. Well, you're seven. Eight. You interview her? Just now before yeah, you. Basically. Oh, that's what's up. Um, yeah, I think you should get somebody that's like, with a like, big personality. Let me get Georgia on here. That's not... Is this a there part of the video? This gonna be I can recommend people for you. Thank you. Yeah, I can this, this not going to be part of the interview. Right. Girl, let me, let, me, let me do this. You don't cut you. stuff out, do you? I do when I'm specifically asked to. But I okay. try to refrain from it. I try to keep it authentic. Okay. I try to keep it authentic. I, I feel that. But, guys, this has been another week, another banger. Hopefully, you can come back on the show. You can, we can yeah. talk about some more shit. Oh, yeah, I'll come back and... Um, Give me some game, as some would say. Because my YouTube channel needs some clicks. Get some, get some um, big personality people on here. Get some big personality people on yeah. here. That's what I'm going to do. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Anything you gotta say? Nope. 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 I'm old. I'm still offended. You take that personally. I wouldn't call you old. That's what I'm saying. You're not old, Brick Brick. I would say, yeah, I would say your age is just right. 
Do you got any questions for me or anything? I, could, I, I wanted to ask you a question, but I like, remember you said, this is not the you interview, this is my interview. But so I was like, all right, I'm going to You can still ask me questions, gang. That don't mean you can't ask me a question. Touch it, touch it, touch it, touch it, touch it. What do you want to ask me? Another question. Um, so what made you start doing YouTube? YouTube? What I, what I started doing the YouTube? Yeah. What made you want to do this? So the podcast specifically? Yeah. Um, shit, I was, I was live streaming on Twitch. Yeah. And... I was just watching myself back, and I was just like, why not start a podcast? You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm kind of like a forward-thinking person, like kind of like learning shit that's going to teach me forward. So that's kind of how I ended up here. Okay, okay. So like, what's like the most craziest interview you think you did? The craziest interview? Yeah. Probably maybe when, maybe when I had Don Baby on here. If she's a woman artist and she she tried to she was basically explaining the story about how a nigga tried to kill her like and I was like damn like you should go to the police she was like no nah, that's cool though fuck that nigga that's basically what's her answer mm. but yeah that was probably the most craziest moment and then that's about it what was, what was the most the video when you when it was the most tension in the room Oh, definitely big kin nuts. <laughs> definitely big kin nuts. That nigga balled his fist up at me mid interview. I ain't see that. Yeah, it's it's later interview. Imagine you talking to I him. I watched that whole interview. I ain't see that. Yeah, he, he nigga balled his fist up at me. The nigga the nigga that was sitting right here, mm-hmm. that was the nigga that balled his fist. But he in jail right now. Oh he oh I thought you said <laughs> Ken uh balled his fist up. No, he he oh, right. big kin nuts oh, specifically right. was cool. It was just like his predecessors. That That's, was I seen the video. <laughs> That was a good video. That was a good video. I, I didn't think it was a good video. I was scared. <laughs> no. and, then, and then you know the dynamic. It just be me and my girl in here. Like I don't have nothing to defend these things <laughs> off. I got I got pepper spray in there. But I'm, I'm get my ass whipped by the time I grab it. I would say one thing. If you feel scared, I feel like you should be like, hmm, this gonna be a good video if you feel scared. Yeah. I think well that should be a back in back in your mind. Back though. in the back yeah. of your mind. Okay. Yeah. I get I can give I can see how you say that. Yeah. I, think, yeah, he said, I did see that in the back, but it was like at the end of the day, these niggas might shoot me in the office. They not like nigga. I'm not gonna get my if them niggas shot me dead in this office. I'm not gonna get my security deposit back, gang. <laughs> I'm gonna be fucked. How you get you no know, security deposit back, dead? But I mean, but like just how how like how renting out works. Like you gotta get a security deposit and a lease and all that shit. Yeah. Like shorty went to pay that shit off. I mean, <laughs> dead with debt. Oh, you thought they was they would have. Oh, right, right, right. Okay. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, it's not about me. I can give a fuck about myself. I, I try, I try to, I try to give a fuck about myself. But that's neither here nor there. Mm-hmm. Any more questions? Uh, I can't really think of none right now. I'm sorry you don't think I asked the good enough questions. I, I no, no, no. I ain't say you asked good questions. But she, no, she said cool. I didn't ask. Good. She said. Oh, I they could have been more in depth. Mm-hmm. So his audience can get to know him more. I can see that, but yeah. niggas don't be wanting to get in debt. You know what I mean? We, we can't in, force we a nigga. In debt. I mean, you can't force a nigga to get in debt. That's okay. Right. Definitely right. That's okay. As co-hosts, I got you. I got you. You have them down. Yeah. You have, you like, questions so you gonna be there every interview now, or just just um, one day? Maybe every other. She she every she's other. filling it out. She don't know. Tasha, Tasha, it's just Tasha. it's just convenient. You need somebody like that though, because. I don't know who your partner was saying you had good t-shirts on. That's crazy. You got to stay away from bro. That's <laughs> Nobody said that shit. Oh, I thought, or you called somebody else. I thought, oh, right. No, that was Anton. That was, that's a personal friend, but he not my friend no more. I just cut him off live. Doing this oh, all right, all right. Yeah, Antoine, you crazy. Antoine, you a bitch. Yeah, that's wild. Ooh. Moment of silence for him being a bitch. <laughs> On that note, thank you for tuning in for the episode. Hopefully, you tune in for the next one. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. And goodbye.